Back again for another edition of Journal Journey, writing prompt number 39. Um, as always, please, if you haven't, check out Flintlocked, the comic book I co-wrote and co-created. That would be really appreciated. Um, that's available on Amazon. Purchase that in Kindle form or paperback. Have that shipped to you. But um, let's see here. Writing prompt number 39 is... Write a poem that describes how you feel about war. Um, I'm not really a poet. Mine's more just kind of like a statement. Um, and I think you can kind of get how I feel about it. War. What is it good for? No, that's... <laughs> um, I wish that was my poem. War. It feels unfortunately necessary. But I was probably raised to think that. Um, honestly, when I'm broached on the topic, I think about many questions that I would like to ask. How about we focus on mental health? How about we focus on equality? How about we focus on education? How about we focus on taking care of the homeless? How about we look at the large economic gap and how most of our rich are avoiding taxes. Maybe. I mean, just maybe we should focus on some of that, if not all of those things, before even thinking about the fact that uh, a war which seriously costs both lives and money. So, I, yeah, I... I just... I. I learned growing up, going to school, obviously, that, like, seeing all the statistics and whatnot about war, it just, um, I know that it's never going to be completely gone, but I just think that there's so much, at least for the country that I'm in, the U.S., that we need to do here, that that should be the bottom of our priorities. I mean, especially seeing how everything's been affected by this economic, we have a large divide in our country. And um, will that lead to a war within ourselves? I mean, I feel like it's already happening, just not in the way that we're used to. But um, yeah, very, very deep topic. Um, but yeah, I just don't really think we need that. I think there are tons of higher priorities.